Hey Scorpio, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, honey. It is always a blessing to have you back. Um, if you're if you're new here, welcome. And if you are returning, welcome back. You know you're a diamond, shine bright like a diamond. Now I do pray here on my channel for those of you that are new here. And after my prayer, I'll tap into your energy, Scorpio. And kind of see the messages that's come through for you guys. Okay. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading. Using my body as a vessel. Giving me the right words and giving me the right messages that you want me to share. The ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I do give you all the honor and all the praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, Scorpio, this is a general reading. It will not resonate to every single one of you. Take from this reading what resonates to your situation and leave the rest. It could be a person's energy past, but not a future person, even for the cross watchers who are watching. This one could be for you as well. And if you do need to have a personal reading with me, Scorpio, please do not hesitate to check the description part of today's video on how to connect with me to have a personal reading done, okay? All right. All right, Angel, step into the energy of Scorpio, please. What's the message for Scorpio? What's the message for Scorpio, please? All right, Scorpio, that one definitely did want to come through. All right, so Scorpio, what I'm getting here is someone may be dealing with some kind of an illness here. Maybe for some of you, you may not be feeling so good right now. I'm getting you might find out about something, what is causing. Maybe you had some tests done, trying to find out what's really happening, what's really going on. This could be for you. This could be someone that's in your energy. Hmm. That's what I'm getting here. Okay. I'm trying to figure out what's really happening here. And then I'm getting profession here. Okay. This profession is giving me a talent. Um, This talent, I feel like... This is something that you might like to do, want to do. But someone is dealing with fright. So there's a lot of things that come in through here in these four cards, okay? I'm getting, for some of you guys, why am I feeling someone is feeling hell, but you're not really, okay? It's just that you're dealing with fright. It's like whenever you kind of, it's like you get a nervous stomach, anxiety is what I see coming. It's messing up your social life here. Um, It's messing with your talent. It's, mess, it's messing with your forward movement here is what I see coming in here. Fright, okay? Anticipating the moment, but the angels are saying that you need to come up with a strategy to overcome this feeling because this feeling is um a set back that's what i'm hearing a setback i'm getting this time that you start planning for future movements here it's time that you kind of start and predicting what's going to happen or what you need to move forward as far as your life is concerned um i feel like for some of you you just need to read your own mind okay is what i'm getting read your own mind here all right, clarify these cards, please, angels. Clarify these cards, please. Clarify these cards, please. Clarify these cards, please. Okay. The high priestess. All right, so now you're about to manifest um, what you really need for your life here on a spiritual level, a spiritual calling, because it is needed. See, the lover's card is here. And with the lover's card being here and the high priestess being here, I'm getting manifestation. I'm getting with this illness. I feel like this is something where someone is like in bed crying about a situation here. And just not even wanting to work, get out of bed here because of fright. Tap into your energy, honey. Okay? Because this lover's card is having me feel like you're dealing with a karmic situation or a toxic situation here. Or whoever you're pulling in is dealing with this lover's card. Very toxic, very karmic, and having someone feeling damn sick. You're not really sick. You're just dealing with fright. You come up with a strategy here, okay? For some of you, 
um, your situation because you this is what you want. This is what you're kind of living and breathing and, and thinking about every day. It's in the reverse. This is the Ten of Cups. It's in the reverse. Someone is not there. Someone left. Okay, someone left this happy ending here, okay? Now I'm feeling like someone is either choosing to wait, wait things out, um, still kind of hoping here that they will have the situation come back towards them. Um, still feel like you might still have the power to change one's mind is what I'm hearing. No, honey. You don't change anyone's mind. People change when they feel fit. Yep, it does because the strength card is in the reverse. Your war card is also here in the reverse. The three of cups. The three of swords is also in the reverse. The four of cups is in the reverse. Come on. Come on. Okay. All right. I do feel like you not only you have to come up with a, a tragedy, strategy. Okay. But you're going to have to really manifest here because what I see is sadness coming in, boredom coming in, third party coming in. For some of you, you might have already known about this third, this third party situation here. I do feel like this is definitely slowed on your movement as far as your manifestation with your finances, with your career, with your happiness. It's taking a lot of strength out of you. Now it's time that you really start praying, my darlings, and putting your life back in order, okay? Because you cannot wait for anyone to make changes for you. The only person that can make a change for you, honey, is God, okay? That's it. And wh however you decide to worship, okay? But not mankind. Not even I, okay? Okay, so the store of swords is in the reverse. Um, and so is this seven of cups. I feel like um, nothing is changing. There's nothing has changed here, okay? Um, but I feel like... There's a decision that needs to be made here. Decision is not yet made, okay? It's not yet made because someone is still hoping that this Four of Pentacles will manifest with them, all right? But this Four of Pentacles is holding on to the way they feel fit. They're very stubborn, okay? Very stubborn here. Okay. Seven of Wands. Okay, so there's still a fear of fight that's coming in here. With the Magician being here... The nine of pentacles um, and the five of pentacles in the reverse. I do feel like change is coming. When, as soon as you're starting to manifest what you want, pray in spiritual power. Pray, my darlings, okay? Start tapping to spiritual form and pull what is, what is that you need towards you. Because, see, this is in the reverse, okay? Um, you're looking for stability and balance, but someone is choosing not to give that to you. It's, they're choosing to put up a fight. Put up a resistance here. Um, hmm. Wow. The Eight of Pentacles, the Chariot, the Tower in the reverse, the Devil in the reverse. I do feel like you want to put this work in. you, But you're making really tiny steps here. Or this could be a person that's giving you hope that they will want to change some things. Or your situation wants to change some things. But it's coming in rather slowly here. Now, if this is you, okay, I see you trying to make the effort, but making baby steps, the baby steps are having things to fall apart here because this tower is here. And not only is it here, but it's also in the reverse. In the reverse, the devil card did also show up in the reverse, okay? Very toxic energy here, very karmic. It's time that you move away and walk away from that, okay? Now, it is needed to ups and separate yourself from this feeling, from this emotion, okay? Simply because someone is dealing with a lot of fright here. Fright, hurt, and pain, okay? Now, the dead card is here, okay? The three of cups in the reverse. The moon is in the reverse. The four of cups. Tell me that you have arrested. You have already thought things through here, all right? Um, things are definitely not going accordingly because of manipulation and ego and, and, and narcissist behavior, okay? I do feel like it's time that you take control here, all right? Um, because something has to change. It has to change. Here's what I'm seeing with this dead car being here. The situation has to change because it's, it's driving you apart. It's driving you crazy here. Tell me more, angels. Tell me more. Yeah, that 
that card came right back. All right. So I see you um, holding on to everything here. But in the reverse, um, it's going to fall apart. Okay. It's going to fall apart. It's time that you go get what it is that you need. Make the effort and make the move because um, this sun cloud is here. Also in the reverse. Okay. The eight of swords in the reverse. You're done. You're done putting up with all of this. See, what I'm seeing here is this person is having you um miserable okay i'm getting that you're miserable everything is seems to be just at a standstill here you're feeling very sad you're very emotional things is not going right this person is choosing to choosing to juggle many things here um including your heart having you feeling just as horrible as they are towards you and here with this nine of swords and this ten of swords Okay, this is what it ends. This is how it the story looks, right? Anxiety, depression, okay, um, you name it, okay? You feel like this person might have uh, just really sold you a dollar in a dream, okay? And having you have it walking in fear here, okay? The page of pentacles in the reverse, the knight of pentacles in the reverse. This person is not coming in with nothing, even though you want to manifest this two of cups with this person, okay? The queen of cups is in the reverse. The ace of wands is here. The king of swords. I feel like you're putting in all the effort here. All the effort is what you've been doing. They've been giving and giving, but it's time that you stop giving all that you have been giving. Take back your control here to obtain this ace of wands here, which is fine for what you really truly need here because the sun card is also here in the reverse. Okay, um, you need your manifestation and bring these things back, bring, take back your life. Okay, Scorpio, take back your life because you are in a dark place at this moment is what I'm seeing here. A very dark, sad place. Why are you thinking and thinking and thinking? What should I do? What if I do this? What if I don't do this? Do something, okay? Because shit, this shit is not even sincere. If this person come back towards you, all right, whoever the hell they are, past, but or future, or whoever, I feel like things is not going to change because um, the Six of Cups, that was also in the, in the reverse, okay? I don't know what's going on with, with, with your situation here, okay? Um, I feel like you, you already know the answers here is what I'm feeling because this Five of Cups is also in the reverse. You have already know the answer that you're seeking, Whatever it is you're seeking, with clarity or whatever you're trying to find, um, you're in a you're in a dark place here, okay? Trying to find the answers here and having things coming very slowly huh, to, towards you here. What this person is doing to you is wearing a mask here, okay? I'm getting wearing a mask, okay? I'm getting um, conflicts and arguments here, right? That feels like it's not going anywhere, but still trying to build something here that cannot be built and having you searching searching okay searching for answers here constant searching asking wondering where do i go from here okay all right this is going to be your reading for today it's time that you take back your power take back i i, I always say this and for some reason y'all in almost all my reads i always say take your power you need to listen when i say take your power i mean take your power you've got to take your power because honey if you do not take your power all right, you are going to be left behind, okay? You're going to be left behind. You're going to be stuck. You don't need to be stuck because that person is already stuck. The full card is here in the reverse, okay? Someone doesn't know what they want at this moment, all right? Um, finances is not going good. The second chance is as fake as hell. I, I'm getting whatever they're planning on coming to you as you're insane. It, it's, it's, it's not sincere, not right now. I don't see where it's sincere, okay? Justice. Okay? The only thing that I see that's fear is justice that's coming through. Look at this, okay? The five of wands. In, it, it, it's, it's a lot of conflicts here with this justice card and this five of wands, okay? It's a lot of conflicts. It's a lot of things that justice has to do here for anything to resolve. If you was to return back to this sadness, to this illness, to this pain, okay? You'll have to have justice to what justice does. And then your intuition and your spiritual connection will guide you into knowing what direction to take. 
with this dead card being here. It's just a lot of things that you're dealing with right now. Okay. All right, you're you're tired. You're tired of doing all of this, okay? Carrying heavy loads and burdens and stuff. All right, my darling, I'll be praying for you. If you do need me to pray for you, please let me know in the comment section. Um, I will say a prayer um request for you guys tomorrow, okay? Um, if you need prayer for your person, do not hesitate to leave their initials as well. So I could put a prayer in for them as, as well, okay? If you have a family member or a friend that you think might need prayer, my darlings, leave one for them as well. All right, just leave their initial. That's enough. Just their initial will work. Um, pray for me, y'all, as I'll be praying for you. And uh, pray for my sister, too. She's going to do her fourth round of chemo um, this coming Monday. So I will be in Florida very soon, y'all. All right. Someone had comment in one of my videos and said um, that I should be ashamed of myself. Um, for a tarot reader, I should be ashamed of myself living from a hotel. Little did they know that I'm dealing with a sister um, that is fighting cancer. And I have to stay close to where she's getting her treatment. And that is the hotel. I live in Atlanta. What a silly person. Oh, my goodness. Let's pray for that person too, y'all. That is it, y'all. I love you so much. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you in my next one. Until then, don't forget to seek first, and you always find later.